With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, dear student. The question says, 4 charges, 2 coulomb, minus 3 coulomb, minus 4 coulomb and 5 coulomb respectively are placed at all the corners of a square. Which of the following statements is true for the point of intersection of the diagonals? So options are given such that in the first option it is said that electric field is equal to 0 but electric potential is not equal to 0. In the second option, electric field is non-zero, but electric potential is zero. Third option, both electric field and potential are zero. And fourth option, neither electric field nor electric potential is equal to zero. So let's we consider a square. The charges placed at the corners are, suppose the first charge is 2 coulomb, second minus 3 coulomb, third minus 4 coulomb and fourth charge is 5 coulomb and these are the diagonals A, B and C, D are the diagonals and point O is the intersection of the diagonals. So we have to find the electric field and potential at point O. So let's consider uh, the distance A, O or C, O B O and D O are same because this is a square and diagonals bisect each other at 90 degree. Therefore, we can find the electric potential at point O is such that K uh, divided by any one distance. Suppose we are taking this as L. So, this is L. Then within bracket, the addition of all the charges. So, 2 minus 3 plus 5 minus 4. So, this is equal to 0. Hence, we get the electric potential as equal to 0. This is equation number 1. But now, as consideration to the electric field, electric field is a vector quantity. Hence, its resultant will not be equal to 0. So, suppose we are taking here a test positive charge like plus Q0. Then, the electric field for Q0 for minus 3 coulomb will be directed inward. Then for this inward, for this outward and for this also outward. Now all the charges are of different magnitudes. Therefore, when we will be finding the resultant of electric field, it will not be equal to 0. Therefore, let's check the options. Option is electric field not equal to 0 but electric potential is equal to 0. So correct option is option number B. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.